Hello and welcome everyone to the lab view exercises. In our previous videos, we saw how we can build up this door opening and closing simulation. First, we saw how we can build up a numpad and uh, then in the next video, we saw how we can add some buttons and uh, enter the password and see if the door is open or closed. Now, in this video, uh, I have uh, made some more progress with this program and I made it like a gate opening and closing simulation. Uh, I have made uh, further advancements or um, uh, stretched this program out. Uh, now, uh, we will see how this program basically works. So, if I run my program right now, as you can see, uh, we have this numpad in here to enter the password. And also the more tools that I have added in here is this pressure gauge. So let's suppose that there is a car and there is a pressure sensor like this way and it is inside from the inside if the car uh, crosses a specific value or uh, uh, goes above 2000 value then this gate will start opening. So there will be a countdown after opening the gate that will count up to 20 seconds. And once the 20 seconds completes, the door will again start closing. Yes. So now I will clear it out. And now, so now this time, let's just say if there is no pressure from the inside, so it means that there is no car but still we want to open the gate by using some password so let's just suppose that my password right now is 45678 as you can see here as well 45678 now if i press ok the, the door again starts opening uh, but in the meantime uh, it will wait for the 20 seconds uh, but uh, if the, in the meantime when the gate is open or it is closing there is a sensor that checks the obstacle which means that if there is uh, the distance sensor checks if there is something uh, in the gate which is uh, like uh, only uh, in, which is less than four then it will stop closing which means that there is something in between the gate so it must not close until unless the obstacle is not removed so in the when the uh, when the sensor just checks if there is something in between the gate then it will not close so as soon as we the distance sensor uh, distance in, is increased it means that the obstacle is removed uh, then it will close so yes that's how it works so one other function that uh, here is the doorbell which means that if we press the doorbell and then there is an open gate uh, uh, button is appeared uh, so that if we press this button again the door could be open from the inside so that's how this program works and now we can check out this program's block diagram so everything uh, starts from the beginning which in which uh, where we have just exercises uh, from before which we made in our pre previous videos so here the uh, beginning is just similar to that you can just refer to my previous videos i will attach the link uh, in my videos in here and then the changing is in this case structure so we have added uh, a state machine function uh, if uh, by using some multiple uh, opening gate opening options so we have used an or case in here which means that if the pressure goes above 2000 then it should open the gate and then there is an option like if we press the bell button and the ok button is pressed then again it should give a zero uh, case structure which uh, triggers this straight machine function and the gate will open and uh, similarly if there is something in between the uh, gate which pressure sensor uh, senses then there is a state machine brings it to the pause function which means that the gate will stop closing so that's how uh, we have made a state machine function in here which says that gate close which means there is a little bit of simulation which says the gate should close by uh, adding or uh, decreasing by one 
so here is the stop function and then if there is hurdles we can also check how many case structures are there we have stop hurdle gate open pause and gate close so there is a state machine function is also implemented in this case here so yes that's how it works and now it is all up to you how much far you want to extend this program by adding many more functions in it uh, but, but whether you want to make an implementation of saving the opening and closing gate uh, data in the excel sheet that's uh, you can also add many other functions by what you want to do uh, with this program so uh, you can if you like my work uh, and my uh, exercises you can support my channel by going on to the lab view exercises channel and then there is a paypal function that i have in, in integrated recently and you can just donate to support this channel thank you so much